Imagine stepping into a sleek teleportation booth, pressing a button, and instantly appearing on a sunny beach halfway across the world. Sounds amazing, right? But here's the twist. To teleport you, the machine scans every atom in your body, vaporizes you, and then rebuilds an exact copy at your destination. Now, you're sipping coconut water on the sand, but wait, was the person who stepped into the booth really you, or did you just create a perfect clone? This mind-bending scenario is known as the teletransportation paradox. It asks a simple but unsettling question, if your original body is destroyed and replaced by a copy, does you survive the process? Or is that beachgoer just a brand new person who thinks they're you, with all your memories and quirks, but missing that mysterious spark that made you, well, you? Philosophers have argued about this for ages. Some say identity is all about your memories and personality, so if the copy thinks and feels like you, congrats, you made it. Others argue that your sense of self is tied to your physical continuity, and the moment your atoms are scrambled, you are gone, replaced by an uncanny doppelganger. So, next time you're daydreaming about teleporting to Paris for a croissant, consider this, would you really be the one enjoying that flaky pastry, or would it be someone who just thinks they're you? The teletransportation paradox reminds us that even the coolest future tech comes with some seriously weird questions about what it means to be ourselves.